Hey guys, today we have the, the ASUS G751J and actually what we're going to do is we're just going to do a battery replacement, you know. Um, so you're probably thinking, hey, this probably isn't too bad. Um, why do you really need a video about it? Well, let me just pop up the battery on the back right here. Oh, oh wait, there's no latch. Normally the older models actually have a little latch right here. But I guess this one, hmm. So what you need to do, you actually need to pop this up. You pop up the keyboard and even actually remove the display, uh, at least from the screw socket. So we'll show you how to do that real quick. You can take it out with like some tweezers or something. You just need to pretty much remove them. And there's actually screws underneath each one. So you just lift them up like that. There's a bunch, so it'll take a little while. I'll speed this up. Okay, so once you remove those rubbers, uh, the next thing you want to do is actually pop this little piece in the middle up. You can kind of use your fingernail. It's still a little bit difficult, so let's get like a little pry tool or something. There we go to help us lift it. Okay. All right, and now we can actually get the screws all the way around. Um, let's do that real quick before we get started into these screws. Pretty much the whole keyboard needs to pop up so you can remove the stuff on the back, so. Then you want to flip it, and we need to remove the top part, this this top piece here. So let's see if you can do it. Okay. So you just want to be able to go around, and then you pop it on each side. So you pop it there, and it kind of just comes up. Okay. There you go, it just pops up and don't pull it completely up yet because there is speaker cable right over here. So you can see this plastic piece, where does this connect? Oh, and this one, this is actually part of the palm rest. So we need to remove that as well just to get to this. And before you completely pull it up, you can see this is up here. There we go. Now you can see it. Actually, there's three. So there's one there, and then there's those two white ones. Um, all you have to do, there's little flaps. You can just flick it up. So now it comes up, pulls up. No problem. Always be really slow and careful because there still could be something you missed under there. How are you supposed to really know? So again, here are the cables. There's four cables, two white ones in the keyboard and the backlight. Okay, so we don't need this anymore. We're going to put this to the side. And you can see right there, it's the battery connector actually right there. Um, I would actually recommend popping that now. Okay. All right, so there's tape. Just remove the tape right there. And then you just can pull out the battery cable. Be very careful. Go straight back. Um, now the battery's out, so we can be much more comfortable doing this. Um, and, of course, to remove the actual battery, you have to take out these two plates and these plates actually are part of the screen so we have to remove the screen to get to the battery look i love asus don't get me wrong but man they're re really making me i'm not going to say the a word you know apple oh i said it so <laughs> remove the plate here So the LCD is actually unscrewed now. 
Um, what you can do, you don't have to totally remove it. Just pull it down a little bit. It should be enough. You can see attached to the battery, there's a screw in the corner there. And there's one on the other side. Okay, so just take the screwdriver. There's just fill heads, nothing too crazy. There's one. And there's two. <laughs> okay, so you do need to get some leverage under here to pop it up. And it does come out. Um, it is a little bit more difficult. There are little um, latches on the side here. There's a little bit of latches, so you just pretty much want to go up like you just want to go up like this. So you just want to install this. Okay, just pop it in just like that, and it'll fit. It'll go flat. There's a little clip. That's all you have to do. Of course, redo the screws. Okay, so you just plug it in, make sure nothing gets caught here. Um, you just kind of just do the reverse of what you just did to get to that. So um, thanks guys a lot for watching. Um, I hope you guys have a good one. If you like this video, please leave a like. It really does help. And even a comment down below. Um, are you guys going to try this yourselves? Or are you guys kind of just kind of watching just to see how some of these batteries are done? What do you think about doing this battery replacement? Do you think they're actually pushing this way? You know, most of the companies nowadays are pushing more towards the... the to make it a lot more difficult to repair or even this is just a battery just to replace but they're still making it a lot very very difficult and everything even a nice name brand like asus um they do a, a few of these things uh i know it's it's a little bit of a pain but hey you can do what you got to do but anyways um thanks a lot for watching you guys have a good one thanks a lot bye